that curriculum being pushed in public schools. And the I think students to be, quote, their true The 700 Club, really. I can't even change it. You might be a redneck. Happy Saturday to you. I am drinking a beer and trying to write a song. Yeah, you heard that right. Write a song. The video I did about home brews with Nate and John. Uh, the reason we got together was to talk about trying to write a song together just for fun. They're, they're the music guys. I don't know how to play an instrument, but um, so I'm trying to write a song. It's hard as, it's really hard. I don't know, I've had like, I take down notes or through the years, or I used to, of things I'd like to write, because I've always wanted to write a song or a poem or something. Because when I was younger, I was really into just writing stuff. Which is kind of funny, because if you ever watch my blog, projectfreedomgrowth.com, my English and grammar is not the best. But I do like putting words together and letting them have a meaning. So anyway, we decided to try a song out. So that's what I'm doing right now is trying to write a song. It's hard. Uh, I don't know how to put a song together. But it's, it's just fun. It's one of my goals this year is to write a song. Just because, why not? Just something different in life and something way out of my comfort zone. Because if you watch projectfreedomgrowth.com, uh, my, in my 2018 goals, I stated that my number one goal this year was to be uncomfortable as much as possible. So I've been eating a whole bunch and my pants have been tight. No. One of, one of the things I'm going to do is write a song. Or write a song with some buddies. It'll be our project. It's just something fun to do. I hope you're enjoying your Saturday. Cheers. night last night I've, I've been sick since Thursday now I'm starting to think if I was sick earlier than that and I just didn't realize it I coughed a million times last night it was miserable so I'm going to the doctor and this will be my first time to have to go to the doctor with no insurance so I'm pretty interested to see how this goes um, I knew this would come eventually and here we are so I'm expecting a pretty hefty price tag but I have to get better. All I, all I did was cough up stuff last night and I'm miserable right now. And then I decided last night to make an online order through Walmart to pick up at nine today. And I'm hoping I'm done with the doctor by then. You talk about something I do not want to do today, but I didn't know how to cancel my order. So here I go to the doctor be interesting there's a first for everything one hour later uh, not too bad I was only there an hour I have sinusitis sinus something whatever so it's not worst case scenario so I'm gonna go get some medication cost me 60 bucks I was surprised that's not really as bad as I thought it was gonna be now the medication that's gonna be interesting to see how much that is at least I don't have the flu and hopefully I'll feel better tonight Time to go pick up my groceries from Walmart. Okay, the medication was 1901. <clears throat> so all in all, I'm out 80 bucks for going to the doctor and getting medication. And it should help me feel better. I was really nervous about going to the doctor with no insurance. I've always had insurance my whole life pretty much. And I just didn't know how much it was gonna be. I really was like, I might have to spend $500. But 80 bucks, that's doable and totally worth the money. That was my experience with no insurance. It's, it could have 
could have been a lot worse, I guess. Don't get me wrong, like if something really bad happens to me, like my wreck at the canyon, if I would have really hurt myself, um, I'm effed. But at least if I get sick, I know I can afford it for at least right now. There might be a time during this year where I'm, I won't be able to afford 80 bucks so easily. But we'll cross that bridge when we get there. We got plans and goals and just part of it right now. Hey, now I get to go, now I need to take my truck to the shop. Money's going out a lot, but not coming in a lot. Not as much as I want, at least. All right, that's all I got. I haven't worked out like over a week because I've been sick. So I thought I'd do something kind of easy like jumping rope. Whoo, yeah, real easy. I'm out of shape bad. I'm just sick still, I guess. But I'm just trying to break a sweat. Whew. Gotta do something. And the whole reason they're over there, that's everything I'm saying just sucks. It's really bad. 